This one's called Vor, and just by the title, it might be heavy. And there were two kind of chill songs back to back, so I feel like we might get back into the heaviness. Sounds like it. I was about to say, these lyrics look like they could be screamed. Oh my god, this reminds me of Loathe. They did cover a Loathe song. Oh my god. Welcome me in, huh? Don't let it in, it'll take everything. I really, I've never in my life heard Sleep Token this heavy before, ever. And I know I haven't checked out most of their stuff, but I've never even heard people talk about them as if they do stuff like this. So this is really surprising for me. This whole song reminds me of um, Heavy Is The Head uh, by Loath. If we get some ambient sections with synth in this song, it's gonna, it's gonna be my favorite Sleep Token song. It just is. I need to shut up. This would be so fun to do a vocal cover for. I'm just in so intrigued right now. Entranced. Oh my god. Jesus. Oh. Oh my god, man. Oh. I can't even talk right now. I really can't. I didn't know they would This is one of the best songs of the year. This tops some of the Inve Animate songs off of Heavener. It just this song does. Or it's at least, it's at least on par with, with, uh, 
Heavener, this song. What is gonna go on? Oh, that vocal was... Do you hear that plucking? It kind of reminds me of like... I don't want to be wrong here, but like Japanese, maybe, music? Something is. This is one of the best songs I've like ever heard. Oh. oh my fucking god, dude. Jesus Christ, this song. I don't even know what to do. I can't even headbang, it's so hot, but... The drums, the guitar... This production is beautiful. It's just a wall of sound. This is just everything I want. Everything I want. I didn't know I was going to love Sleep Token this much. I really didn't.